Yeah, we know who this is. I think this might be Laura from the Normal Women's Alliance. Hello. Hi. Hi, is this Laura? Yep. Awesome. Thanks for calling in. You were uh, down at the Pride event today, collected signatures for medical marijuana, marijuana legalization as well, right? Oh, no, just yeah, marijuana. Um, we, were, we were down at the Pride Festival um, collecting signatures for the public policy question um, in certain towns and cities in Massachusetts. Um, for the state senators to be instructed to vote in favor of legislation that would allow the state to tax and regulate marijuana like alcohol. And we've been getting a lot of signatures, which is great. How many do you think you got down there today? Um, you know, we have just a giant stack of paper, but uh, I would say absolutely in the, in the hundreds. Awesome. <laughs> awesome. How, um, many, how many people were collecting? Um, we have a lot of volunteers, um, people coming in and out all day, um, def- definitely a large presence of volunteers that have been just super great, bringing back just clipboards full of signatures and ready to grab more MDPs to go out and find more people to find them. <laughs> That's great. And uh, it must have been crazy down there today, too, because we saw the traffic coming in here. Yeah, it was definitely busy. It's a beautiful day to be outside. So a lot of people uh, showed up to watch the parade and then come to the festival afterwards. Um, and the Normal Women's Alliance has been meeting a lot of great people um, and letting people know about what we're doing. So, what what is uh, tell us about the Normal Women's Alliance and what you guys are doing? Um, well, we are the New England chapter of the Normal Women's Alliance, and we are uh, reaching out. To women um, who have been, uh, you know, not necessarily uh, completely uh, represented um, within this movement, we really want to get a lot of women on board um, and focusing on issues like education and, you know, keeping children out of jail and just issues that pertain to women um, so that they can help end prohibition because yeah. they were women were a major factor in ending the prohibition of alcohol. So. <laughs> yeah, there's a history there. An important thing. Yeah, that's the way it happened too. It's uh, the women's the women's you know got involved and they ended alcohol prohibition. Well, they also started it. Oh, they yeah they did. It's the women's temperance union. <laughs> yeah, I mean that's the truth too. Like women are uh, women kind of decide these issues. They both start the prohibition oftentimes and then they repeal it. So absolutely and um, with, like. Uh, Normal Women's Alliance, you can find a lot of information on normal.org, but you can also find, you guys have a Facebook group that's local and national, right? What are the two yep. Facebook groups? We have um, a Facebook uh, group that is local, and we also have a group that's national, and we also have, um, for New England and national, we have a Facebook page so you can like us. Um, for New England, it's um, facebook.com slash Normal Women's Alliance New England. Um, and so if you check us out, you can find out that's a really great way to stay in touch and find out what we're doing. Awesome. And you guys do events like today. You are the rallying point. I know that uh, I talked to a lot of activists, John Leonard, and we got uh, one here today that collected signatures, Garrett Kirkland in the studio. And that was the place that people were meeting. And the Normal Women's Alliance uh, rented out a space for this Pride March, and they're reaching out to all sorts of communities that's what i like other communities that we're not usually focusing on that we should be focusing on so uh thank yeah. you thank you for being down there and thanks for calling in and thanks yeah, for doing I the work i want to mention um briefly if anybody who's listening wants to get involved with helping with the uh public policy question um they can email alex at taxcannabis.org and volunteer there's petitioning happening seven days a week and this is a really great way to get involved Absolutely. And we like our Alex Arsenault a lot. That's his uh, email. He's the guy running that, you know, this little collection of uh, public policy signatures to get legalization on this ballot this year. It doesn't count, but it's the beginning of the campaign. This is how we did it with Decrem. This is how we did it with Medical. And this is the start of that campaign. Garrett, you have something to say before Laura? Yes, Heads absolutely. Um, there's a list of towns that we are looking for to sign these petitions. Um, so if Laura has the list of towns that we need, that would help a lot. There's a lot of towns, there. actually. Uh, I will speak about that. I mean, we have. You can go online. If you have any questions, you should email Alex. Um, and the reason I say that is because it changes. We, you know, we, uh, we're getting at a certain point that we're starting to add new towns. But we know Boston, Somerville, Cambridge. 
you know, Malden, those are the areas we definitely know. And, and we're going out in the surrounding areas. So there's also a campaign in the North Shore with Steve Epstein. Uh, his email is epegs, E-P-E-G-G-S, at AOL.com. So if you want to find out and you want to try to even get your town added, because they're still collecting money for this. They're still doing this. There's still time. This is the season right now. And uh, I think that the fact that they're still looking for money and they're still adding new places, that's a good sign. That means we're collecting a lot of signatures. We've been promoting it every single week on this show. And uh, thank you so much for calling in today, Laura. Well, thank you for having me. And, um, you know, I hope that people get involved and it's been a beautiful day here. So, Awesome. Uh, have a wonderful show. You too. All right, you're uh, you're listening to Two Hotheads on Cannabis on UnregularRadio.com. That was Laura from the Normal Women's Alliance, New England. Uh, the phone number is 617-606-4122.